Huh. Hello, hello guys, and welcome back to some more World of Warcraft TPC, the classic version of the game, of course. We are standing here in front of, um, what is it called? Northgard? Northhold? I don't know, I, I, I've forgotten already. <laughs> Let's check it out. Uh, it is North Watchhold. Ah, well, we're gonna slay some um, humans. And I guess we have a quest in here that is an escort quest that I hope we can do. But uh, it's not an it's not the most easy one, but we are quite a few levels above them, so it should not be that hard to do. But let's get cracking here. Kill some marine. Need ten of those. But yeah, I think we'll get them before we are done with that escort quest anyway, so should all be good. We are trying to get into the escort right away. Because we can always just turn back and kill some more of these marines if we need to. Oh, it's the metals we need. Okay, fair enough. There you go. Ooh, hello, pirate ship. Or, I don't know, maybe. Maybe it is a pirate ship. I'm not quite sure about that, actually. I've never been out there. Uh, ooh, there's quite a few mobs in there. Let's get him. Get out of here. So I think the plan after uh, we have done uh, this area is to uh, maybe go to Stone to Lone Mountains. I, I, you know, plans can change, but that's my uh, current... Um, Oh, I forgot about... Uh, we need to put on... There we go. Aspect. The ra the correct aspect, that is. Uh, <laughs> but yeah. Plans can, of course, change. But uh, I was thinking that... There's probably a few quests in there that we can do that is a little bit low level. That would turn grey soon enough anyway. So it might be a good idea to go in and do them before they actually turn grey. Instead of doing anything else here in the Barrens. So yeah, uh, I think the quest is up there, the escort. So I think we're going in that general direction. Oh, do we need to kill anything Captain Fair or something here? Uh, where is the quest here? It's right here. We need to do Captain Fairmount, Cannoneer Wissan, and Cannoneer Smithy. Is... I don't really recall if... Where the other ones are. Persevere. Hmm. Can we see that on the map, maybe? I think it's those. Yeah, okay. So it's the um, swords that we need to kill here. So one of them is up there. I think we're, yeah, we're just gonna go for the ramp or whatever it is. Um, uh, path on the mountain. <laughs> because I think all of them are up there. Where are you going, mate? Why did you do that? Now we're pulling more stuff. Lesser healing? Oh, that's annoying. Maybe we should have killed her first. Hmm. Oh well. More XP, I guess. Ooh, I like the music here. Holy smite. Oh, there's another player here. Level 25. Wow, he's he's quite far ahead. Oh, he just did the uh, escort quest that we are supposed to do at some point. So uh, yeah, but we can we can do the other stuff first. We need to kill a couple of uh, these cannoneers, or yeah. So yeah, it's not, it will probably respawn when we are done with that, or close to. Well, it's in that tower. Okay, not the next one. Fair enough. We will come back to do that quest. He's a level 15. We don't actually get any XP for him. Hmm. That's a little bit annoying. Little 15, little 15. Oh, 16. Kill the level 16. Oh, okay. I pulled more than I needed. I pulled something that we don't even get XP for, so that's a bit annoying. Waste of time. 
This is a level 20 quest, isn't it? Yeah, it is, but these are only level 15. Oh, we already have all of them. Good. Don't need to think about that again. And where is... He's probably upstairs, so we need to get in here anyway. Let's kill the healer first. Yeah, I'm, I don't even want to, you know, trap them or anything because they're dying so fast here. That's a bit annoying. Get out of here. Okay. Okay, he respawned really quickly. Or maybe it wasn't a new respawn. I don't know. Maybe there are three in there to begin with. Not quite sure, actually. Hmm. Should be one up here. He's probably uh, not respawned yet. Yeah, that's probably it, actually. I think I'll uh, I'll wait for him because I don't really want to come here again. So uh, just a moment here, guys. Ah, didn't take that long. Oh, it's actually not her or him or whoever, but something spawned. So yeah, the other guy was just here before us, probably. And the level 25 paladin we saw before. So uh, we just have to probably wait a few minutes here again. It's not a big problem. All right, there he is. Took a little bit longer than I thought it would, but he is finally here. We can kill him. Good. Canonia Smithy. Level 19. So that's why the quest is so... I don't understand why they designed the game around that kind of... Where, where the, some of the mobs are like level 15, and then this guy's level 19. Why just not keep them at the same level? That makes it... I don't know. Just a little bit more nice for the players, because... You have such a small window of opportunity to go kill these guys. Uh, you need to be a very specific level to get here. Like level 20 or something like that. Otherwise, you don't get XP for some of them. And otherwise, you can't kill the last one. So, <laughs> it's, it's, it's a little bit odd of uh, game design to me. Okay, there we go. We need to go to another tower on the opposite side here. So, yeah. Probably need to kill a few more marines. Uh, but I'll try avoid as many as I can because, yeah, they're low level. Don't really need to kill them anyway. Actually, put on. Ah, probably not. Guess we need to kill this guy. Yeah. There we go. 70 XP. Not a whole lot. Let's see if we can avoid that guy. Yep. Yeah, we need to kill these guys. Uh, that is a healer, if I'm not mistaken. So let's just go for her. Yeah, my pet could easily kill these uh, guys alone. That's... Um... <laughs> Yeah, they have a quite a long respawn time, these um, cannoneers here. So he might not even be spawned in, but I think he is now. I think he is probably spawned in up there. If I jump up here, will he... Huh. Might be lucky here. Uh, you know what? Just go in. Let's go. Yeah, I, I didn't really. It, it 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 was so fast that I don't I don't really need to do that with the low levels. I barely need to do it against someone my own level. Definitely don't need to do it against someone lower than us in level. When there are two of them, we are just too powerful. Ow! Where's my cat? <laughs> it's not following. Hello. Eh, he's not even spawned in. So how about that? Quite a long spawn time for those guys. Probably five minutes or so. Even more, actually. I don't know, but uh, I'll, I'll stick around until he spawns. There he is. A cannon Wisen. Or Wisen, or whatever his name is. Let's slay the bastard. I don't know if he's a bastard, but I'm going to call him a bastard. 
There you go. Cool. Well, I think we're done with that quest. Um, aren't we? Nope, we need to kill Captain Fairmount. Well, he is in the last tower. So, uh, that's pretty good. That's also where, uh, the tower of where the uh, Iscot quest is. So, it's all good. Easy peasy. Let's get over there. Oh, I forgot to loot this guy. Epic? Nope. <laughs> so there's always a, uh, an epic in, in those uh, you, you forgot to loot, isn't there? At least uh, in your mind, there is. Uh, can we jump down here? Maybe. Well, potentially. Potentially. Yeah, let's go get this guy. Where's my cat? Come on, cat. There we go. Okay. So they're in there somewhere. Let's go for Captain Fairmount first. But I think this is God Quest is probably one of the easier ones, so uh, I'm not really worried. Especially now when we have so high level compared to these guys. It shouldn't be a problem, we just need to clear the way. Let's get her out of there. Might pull more. Yep. Let's get him first. She is a goner. Now we can concentrate on her. Ouch. 39 damage from a holy smile. Resist. Haha. -ha. Lesser healing. I don't really care about the lesser healings. Um, it's when, when the mobs have those major healings where they're just getting all their health back. That's so annoying, man. It's just unbelievably annoying. It, actually, I would say many of the mobs that do have healings where they're just getting health back like that, uh, you know, full health, that is probably the hardest mobs that you can you can get uh, um, in the in in the open world, except from world bosses and stuff like that, because th that healing can really screw you over, man. It can really really do things you don't like. Bit of in, bit of a tight spot here. 124 on that arcane shot. Nice. I'm not even using any abilities anymore. I'm just, you know, letting the cat do the job. Maybe fire an arcane shot. I'm not using any serpent stings. I'm not really. Sometimes I'm using a raptor strike. Never using the mana taps or arcane torrent. It's uh, <laughs> I don't know. I, I don't really need to. So it, I guess it doesn't really matter too much. Uh, okay, let's kill this marine here. Probably need to kill all of them, actually. But some of them are low level, but yeah. It is what it is. Still wanted to do the quest, so I had to... I mean, if I knew that we had this many low level mobs, I might have avoided this quest. But uh, I didn't remember. I didn't recall that that was the case. That's the thing. That's the thing. I have probably been here, I don't know how many times in my lifetime, five, six, seven, eight, I don't know, actually probably more than that. And I still don't remember stuff like that. It's, it's funny how the mind is working, at least my mind. <laughs> uh, yeah, stuff like that, it's, it just doesn't, you just don't remember it, or at least I don't. That's, um, but I remember stuff a lot better if there is a, you know, a storyline to it. And I don't know if I will, I'll remember this one because I don't really remember the storyline for this quest. Uh, but some of the other quests we have done, at least many of them, I will remember the the, the mobs attached to them a lot better because of the storyline that we have been, uh, that the text-to-speech text have been telling us. And uh, you know what? I, th I feel like... I really needed that for this game. I really did. Because there are so many areas, there are so many mobs to kill, and I I, I forget I, I, I forget them. Really, I do. I simply just forget them. And uh, this way, I'll remember them just a l just you know, just a tiny bit better. 
There we go. Um, let's kill the priest first. Yeah, go in. Kyle, there we go. Oh, well, that was uh, that was fast. Good night. Where is the uh, quest? Uh, oh, it probably hasn't spawned. It's probably a 10 minute spawn timer or something like that. The, uh, yeah, I, I, I would think so. I would think so. I don't know if I want to stick around for that because. Ah, <sighs> well. Do I really want to wait for that? No, I think I think the answer is no because we could we could sit here and wait for five minutes and then we still need to kill all the respawns, the level fifteen respawns. I don't think it's worth it to be honest. I don't really think it's worth it. I mean, there, yeah, my patience have run out with this place. <laughs> I don't think it's worth uh, waiting for it. So I think we are gonna leave this area again. But that was also okay. I mean, we did get one quest done. And uh, I think we are gonna run back to Ratchet here. To deliver that quest. And then we are probably gonna run toward... How are we getting down from here? Jesus, that's uh, that's pretty, that's pretty steep. Uh, I think I can maybe jump this cliff. Yeah, that's okay. Ouch. Uh, not too bad. Yeah, I think we're running back to Ratchet, and then we will uh, head towards... Oh, it's this way. <laughs> Confusing myself here. Oh, God. And then head for uh, Stones Alone Mountains. Let's see if we can get out here. Should we just run for it? Nah, just kill some. Look at how many things we would have needed to kill, and also probably needed to wait another... Well, up to five minutes. Uh, likely for that quest. I don't think it's worth it. At least in in terms of uh, waiting waiting for it, it wasn't really worth it. In terms of maybe getting the quest, um, the storyline. Well, yeah, you can you can argue that you can argue that. But you yeah, we can't do all quests. It's um, I mean we could if we were following some kind of guide that made it very um, you know efficient. Uh, the way we are playing, but we don't. I don't know. Okay, he probably locked out. He, I think he locked out. Hmm. Oh yeah, we can't get all the quests, so um, yeah, whatever. We'll leave some. We'll, we'll leave some of them alone, and um, but for the most part, we will of course do. I mean, here in the Barrens, we are not even doing half of the quest because many of them are low levels now. So that's just that's just how it is. It's just how it is. The way we are playing here. But uh, we will run back to, to Ratchet now. Okie dokie, back at Captain Thalothas Brightson. I am honored. My fleet is in peril with Captain Fairmount and her damned cannoneers blasting away from Northwatch Hold. I want her soldiers to pay as well. Fill my hand with medals from their dead and I will know that vengeance has been given to my fallen privateers. I don't remember hearing that the last time around. Maybe I skipped it. I don't know. Alas, the Righteous Alliance guns have been silenced. You shall be rewarded for your aid, Relum. Now to tend to the grim task of recovering the bodies of the dead. Okay, well, that doesn't really work for me, right? This this, this doesn't really... What about this gun? This gun is a is better than the one we have, but we can't use guns yet. But I'm going to pick it, just in case we are going to go somewhere where we can get guns. So, uh, yeah, Good let's luck, take it. Brain. I do also believe we had a pair of shoulders. That's the first pair of shoulders, actually. They're not really good, but you know what? Let's put them on. Oh, they don't, they don't really look great, but you know what? It's just a bit of extra armor. Uh, what about uh, these are not really that great, and that is the gun we just got. Yeah. All right. It's all good. Let's clean up the backs here. And uh, I think we are going to grab a bat. Yeah, it's a bat. Uh, back to crossroads, and then we are gonna turn west over to Stone to Down. So uh, yeah. Well, we are about to leave the barons behind us, and uh, that is Stone to Down in front of us. We do have a couple of quest givers down here, if I'm not mistaken. 
And uh, they are, you know, on the verge of being low levels. But uh, yeah, I, I kind of ignore level 16 quest right now because I actually just checked one right here. <clears throat> and yeah, it's level 16 and we can get it and it's green. But all the mobs we have to kill is level 15. So yeah, uh, that is not really great. <laughs> so, uh, but here we are in uh, just, well, it's actually technically still the Barons, but Whatever. Let's uh, speak to Sereth Stonebreak here. What can I do for ah, you? Ah, a hunter. Very good. We will need your skills to deal with these plunderers. Okay. Strength. The Goblin Run Venture Company moved into the Stinedalon Mountains, chopping down trees and burning huge stretches of forest. The spirits of this place are nearly blinded with pain and rage. We must stop the Venture Company. Head northwest, beyond the Gritwood Vale and into the Winchkeer Crag. You will find the goblins and their servants at work. Show them the Horde will not allow the exploitation of Stenetalon. Show them in the language they best understand. Violence. Hmm. We will show them violence then. Pesky goblins. The Grim Totem clan raided my village and killed most everyone. I killed all I could, but barely escaped with my life. Rilum, all I wish now is that more of them are dead. You will find them just to the west of here. Jesus. Okay. Fair enough. I guess we will kill some ruffians or whatever their name was. Um, yeah. So, let's see. Where are we? Oh, that's the... Uh, okay. Yeah, we'll probably do that first. And then pick up some of these quests, maybe. We will see about that. But I think we can start killing these um, Grim Totem mercenaries first. Should be a pretty easy quest to do. Then turn back in with that quest. Yeah, they're probably quite low level. They're level 14. And 15. Uh, yeah, that's... Wait, hold on. Get rid of the barons. Open stones alone. And get rid of this quest, I think. Because it's not really worth doing it. When they're uh, not giving any XP. To be honest. May actually, may hold on. Hold on. Maybe these over here is going to turn level 17. Let's check them out. No, they're level 13. You know what? Let's ignore that quest then. It's it's not really um It's not really that important to do these quests if they are not giving us any XP. Be gone! Abandon quest. Might do the same for the other one. It's actually a little bit annoying because it's it's really hard to to, to <sighs> that that's what I was saying before as well. It's if, if a quest is level 18, I expect the mobs to be level 18 as well. <laughs> but that's not the case in World of Warcraft. Uh, the, I, don't rem I, don't, I don't remember what level the mobs are. So it's, it's, it's just... Yeah. It's, it's not great. Uh, I think it's a bad experience. It's, it's, it's just annoying. Um, level 18, I believe that is actually an escort quest. Level 19. Up here. I don't, I don't recall. This quest up here, I don't recall what that is. I, I, I want to check it out. I want to check it out. And we will probably also do the escort quest. Uh, I don't recall this village at all. I don't remember this place. Interesting. Let's see what uh, this guy got to say. How you doing? We trolls here at Malakajan have prospered from the land. Stone and Alon Mountain offers great hunting for us to live on. Lately, we have attracted the wrong dinner guests. The spiders in these mountains have been raiding our comps at night looking to steal our hunt. If you were to help us kill off these ghastly beasts we at Malakajan would be in your debt. Spiders are everywhere in Stone Alon. Just head north from here and you will see what I am talking about. Okay. Let's hope the, the mobs is actually high enough level to, uh, for us to, uh, to get something out of it. I don't know. If they're level 17, it would be great. 16 even. Just just a, just a tiny bit of XP and I'm okay with it. Otherwise, I'm getting annoyed by killing something I don't get XP for. So, <laughs> But uh, we'll see. We will see. Oh, there is actually another quest in there. That's a level 26 quest. Interesting. Let's go get it. I mean, we might as well now when we are here. Again, I don't, I don't recall this area at all. I do, I do recall this quest we just got uh, for killing uh, the spiders, but I didn't um, didn't recall it was in here that we got it. Oh, there is a cave. What is this area? Well, it's a troll. It's a troll area. 
But uh, yeah, and it's trolling me a little bit. You come get the so excited I am. Three little cages for three little elves. But what shall we do with our lovely tree hugging friends? <laughs> Why, let's give them a taste of what do they call it? Forest magic. I'll need a good mess of Stenetal and Sap. From those horrid felines, bring me some Twilight Whiskers. This calls for plenty of coarser eyes, of course. Can never have enough eyes. Oh, and lest we forget, a precious scale from a Fey Dragon. Hurry to Stenetal mm. and Peak, reel them, so I can brew some forest magic. Alright, <laughs> sure. That was actually quite great. Um, oh, night elves. <laughs> Alright, got that quest. Not sure where it is. It's probably up there. Yeah. Cool. No worries, we will get to that uh, at some stage. But yeah, there's probably going to be some quests that we're going to delete again that we are not going to do because, yeah, they turn grey. Yeah, it, that's just what it is, I guess. It's, it's um, yeah, a bit annoying, but that's, uh, that's what you get when you're not following a guide and it's not doing it efficiently. But I don't want to follow a guide. I really don't. I'd rather be a little bit annoyed. Level 16, huh? See, I want to do this escort quest in here, so we are going in here and doing it. If it's there, it might be gone, but you know what? There's a good chance it is here because these mobs are around. So uh, that's a little 15, that's annoying. Yeah, we are definitely a little bit too far ahead in terms of our uh, level right now compared to what we are, um, the quest we are doing. But, yeah, I'd rather do some of them and not miss out on them. But it is what it is. <laughs> yeah, and in the last couple of episodes, we were a little bit behind. Well, there we go. Guess uh, that's just what it is. Kaya Flathoof. Greetings. Thank you for rescuing me. We must leave quickly before they discover that I am free. Please escort me to Camp Apparage. From there, I know my way. My father, Makaba Flattooth, will be desperate to know that I am safe. Alrighty, let's go then. Yeah, she, she's not gonna walk that uh, fast, so it's gonna take some time. See if she's attacking anything out here or pulling aggro. Nope. Good. Should we uh, walk with her? Oh, that didn't work. Wait, what is it? Uh, I think I think I changed the uh, <laughs> the key binding for it. Not that I actually need to do it. Interesting that. Okay, now she's attacking it. She's probably gonna pull aggro there. Yep. She's only level 15. Oh, I squeeze. Yeah, nope, nope, didn't squeeze through. <laughs> I believe we are supposed to get down here and then we are getting ambushed or something like that. Just to spoil it for you guys. How may I aid you? I guess, I guess we can walk backwards in the same tempo. I mean, I could take my cheater off. That's gonna help a little bit. Oh, it's such a far. It's it's such it's a distance. Uh, walk faster, okay? Yeah, run. But she's not gonna do it. Ah, <laughs> uh, oh well. I think this is why we hate escort quests. It's just it feels like a little bit of a waste of time. 
I mean, we do get some XP out of it, but... There's a lot of this going on with, with the escort quests. Oh, hello. Level 70? What a pissy. Not sure what he's doing here. Maybe just... I don't know, maybe some reputation hunt or yeah. something like that. Could be. Doing some low-level quest for reputation. Okay. Well met. Well met. Let's feed Kyle. He's unhappy. Well, he wasn't really unhappy. He was just not happy. Are you going to attack us? No. I guess not. Oh, let's see. I believe there is an ambush here. Oh, yeah. There we go. Is he getting health back? What happened there? Look kind of odd. Oh, you, you, you. <laughs> <laughs> now she's saying it. Okay. I, I wish there was a way for the text to speech to recognize this without uh, the other thing. I really do, but uh, that's not the case. Uh, where are we delivering that quest? Right back here. Okay. You know what? We are just... We are almost there. So we might as well just run up there and deliver it. Okie dokie. Back here again with the flat hoof. Let's deliver the quest. What brings you here? Kyo is alive. Rilam, I have you to thank for rescuing her. Yes, you do. Tell Tamara Winfield, Kyo's and who's at Sunrock Retreat, about the good news. Kyo is alive. We had thought she was lost after the brutal attack on our village. Follow the path to the west to get to Sun Rock Retreat. Cool. We will do that. Actually, we will do exactly that. But we will probably start slaying a couple of uh, of these feeders, blood feeders here, and also probably do the uh, this quest right here. I believe we can do that as well while we are at it. So uh, I'll see you in just a moment when we find some spiders to kill. All right, I have killed quite a few of these spiders, actually five of them are already. And um, we are about to kill a few more, I guess. But also get over here and look at this lovely little sign, which is a quest to kill a bigger spider. Warning, proceed into Sisha Canyon west of here at your own risk. Besseleth and her eight legged children of the forest have claimed this canyon as their web lair. Magran Earthbinder in Sunrock Retreat has placed her bounty on Besseleth. Slay her and bring proof of your killing to Magran, there you will receive your reward for disposing this eight legged menace. Cool. Yep, we are definitely gonna go in there. We will kill a few more of these creepers. I think we need ten in total of those. We are at six, so that's good. Seven. No worries there. We will probably get them when we get out again from this cave. Uh, sorry, it's not a cave. It's a canyon. More there. But yeah, let's go find the big spider here. A uh, couple more creepers. Seems like we uh, I, I counted out the correct number <laughs> because we do have a couple more before they turn into venom splitters, if I'm not mistaken. I don't know why I remember this quest so good. That's you know some quests just just sit in your mind uh, and you just remember them a little bit better than others. 
Um, for no, absolutely no good reason. Uh, not sure why. There is a druid in here, so... Yeah, uh, Maybe... He killed the... The big spider. Potentially, I think. It's over here somewhere. I don't see it, so... I think he might have killed it. And it got quite a long spawn time, but the good thing is we do need to kill seven of these venom splitters. And we also need to destroy some eggs, so uh, while we wait for a respawn on uh, on that to happen... Yeah, I don't see it. It should be... What happened there? Is that a respawn? Probably. I believe it should be over here. Oh, he's there. Okay. Good. Bestleth. Or... Bestleth. I don't know. Something like that. Let's kill it right away, because otherwise someone might get to it before us. And it does have, like, five minute respawn time, so... Let's just get, get it over with. Then we can do the rest of the other quest in here. There we go. Now we need to find some eggs. I don't see one there, but let's just kill this dude. There's one here. And I actually believe they spawn even more uh, things. We need to kill fi 15 of these eggs or destroy them. Make some omelets. Ah, uh, that's pretty disgusting omelets. Probably burn. Let's see. No, it didn't spawn anything. Maybe it doesn't spawn when there is actually something in it. Could be. I don't, I don't remember, but that seems to be the case. Ew. The yeah. boss hatchling says, hatches. Okay. The boss hatchling says, Chitters for help. <laughs> uh, you're not getting any help. Okay, a few more eggs, a few more splitters. That's a web spinner. That's another, another mob entirely. The moss hatchling says, hatches. There's one there, okay. Let's kill this one. That's seven out of seven. We're done with that quest, I believe. And 15 out of 15 there as well. That was pretty fast. Okay. Yeah, okay. I guess we are getting out of the this. Uh, kind says, of again. Chitters for help. Good. Good, 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 good. Let's get out of here. And run towards... I don't know. Maybe uh, this guy up here. Sis Physics. Or whatever his name is. Yeah. Small goblin. And we are in the windshield crack. Right next to his house here. Ah. I don't know. Are they too low level down here? Probably not. I think we can probably do a couple of quests down here. Here he is. What's up? I thought those venture company higher-ups were slave drivers, but then I met Spartivalve, the cruelest of them all. Huh. Though it's better than being out of a job, I suppose. Or worse, working with that Girenzo. If you're here to help, I've got something for you to do. Okay, Keep cool. Real. Terrible what the venture company has done here, eh? What were they thinking? Goblin company hiring a gnome. Lucky for me, Spartivalve knows a genius when he sees one. Hired me just after I'd been kicked out. Tells me they built some enormous woodcutting machine, and Spud wants me to steal the plans for him. Unfortunately, Girenzo Bloody Gnome wants me dead on sight. Maybe you could steal the plans for me? You should be able to find them on one of their operators. Yeah, we'll do that. Have a good one. And I don't know if there are more quests down here. There seems to be. There seems to be. A couple more. We also had another quest where we need to kill the Venture uh, Loggers, which is also nice. And then we have this quest over here we might pick up. But I think that's going to be next time. I think we're going to you know, go to sleep in here at the box. Because, yeah, why not? 
<laughs> right next to sis. We need, we need we need our rest time here, uh, because otherwise, uh, I think we'll just die of, of sleep depression or what is it called? Not depression. That's the wrong word. Anyway, guys. <laughs> God, English, English. Oh. Right. Anyway, guys, I will see you around uh, in the next episode.